Hold on here. 40 and 15. Read that. For indeed, I was stolen away out of the land of the Hebrews. That's what happened to you. Read it one more time. For indeed, I was stolen away out of the land of the Hebrews. You were stolen, sister, from your land, from the land of the Hebrews, where Israel do well. Facts. Did you get stolen taken here? Huh? You got stolen from your land. Or, or how ladies like to say, period. Right, right, right. Period. Right. That's what happened. Been beautiful. Man, it's been beautiful. We yeah. talked to so many beautiful Israelites like you. We were talking to so many Israelites, telling them that they not niggas. They not black. You know what I'm saying? They not African American. They not Afro American. Told the Hispanic, he the tribe of Issachar. Right. That's right. You guys chosen people from the tribe of Issachar. Hey, what's your nationality, bro? Quick question, yeah. What? See? See? Say it one more time. What? That's the color. Oh, I just say African American. That's see? Afri see? That comes from two white guys. Afro Leo Scipio Africanus. Now you said you was an educated and American woman. Van Spucci. You are an Israelite from the tribe of Judah. If your father is a so-called black man, then you are, because you are who your father is. Right. You're an Israelite. So you're an Israelite. You guys chosen people. And we got to keep the commandments. That's what we got to do. Give me, Hosea, give me Hosea 4 and 6. Keep doing what y'all doing. Watch this. I'm going I'm to show you what happened when you call yourself black. This is what happened. You too. Oh, you're an Israelite. We got to turn back to the Most High and keep commandments. This is the book of Hosea, chapter 4 and verse 6. My people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. Well, that's what happens to you when you call yourself black. You got no direction, man. No sense of, no sense of anything. Where are you going? And sis, sis. You are this device. Stop playing. Stop. You, you playing. Let me read the rest. You're playing. I'm Read this. It says, My people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. Because thou hast rejected knowledge, right. I will also reject thee. Right. That thou shalt be no priest to me. Right. Seeing thou hast forgotten the law of thy God. What's going to happen? I will also forget thy children. That's why the young man called himself black. Because the Most High has forgotten him. And when the Most High forgets you, you forget who you are. And he'll forget your children. This is prophecy. We done talked to two young men up here. They was like 20 years old. They both said they was black. Time. And he almost white. He looked damn white, calling himself black. Yeah. That's ignorance. Destroy. He had a Caucasian mama and in the car. Ignorance is bliss, but just because he's light skinned doesn't make him. No. Not what he thinks that he is. No, we <laughs> different shades of brown, sis. Uh, you forget something that you don't know in the first place. Uh, that's the curse. That's the curse. They say what you don't know won't kill you. What you don't what you don't know will destroy you. Right. You can have a baby. She may not know that if she's she stick her finger in the plug that it will electrocute her to death. But will it? It will. What you don't know will kill you. That's part of the curse, calling yourself a color. That you weighing on the other side of the spectrum. Damn, what is that? I don't know if it's on it. You see Isaiah 1 and 3. We are here one for more, you. Sis. One more, sis. We are here for you. One more. Isaiah 1 and 3. Read that. The ox know of his owner. Why? So we strong, right? An ox is a strong animal, right? He know who he belonged to. Read. In the ass, his master's crib. So we're 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 uh, uh compared to these animals, strong and stubborn. Cause ain't that what you is? You strong and you stubborn. Read. But Israel do but it. Who? But Israel do if not know. Uh huh. My people do if not consider. Said his people don't know who they is, and they don't give a damn. 
But Lisa ox in the ass. They strong and stubborn, but at least they know their way home. Yep. They know who they belong to. Yep. He said his, his, his people dumber than that. And on top of that, they don't even care. So who's the sheep? We the sheep. We the sheep. But we compare to a Knox, and we compare to an ass, and we also compare to a sheep. He said it. What? The sheep, the sheep yeah, until they go astray. And that's where we at. We went astray. We going to straight. We doing whatever the hell we want to do. Oh, it sounds good. Ah, right, yeah, yeah. I, I appreciate what y'all are doing, but that really ain't for me. They say you can take a jackass. <laughs> Merry Christmas. <laughs> we can take an ass, a jackass, from here, drop it all the way at Martin's on, on the lake somewhere. And then to find his way back. That's how smart an ass is. Right. That's why he compared us to that. Because the jackass can find his way home like that. She told me I don't want to hear that shit. All right. she, called, she called me up by my name. She said, Sheikah, you don't want to hear that shit. See that? Give me now, Mark 4 and 14. What did she say? What? She'll be one that's screaming, oh God, when that calamity comes. Give me Mark 4 and 14. Mark 1 and 14. That's, what, that's the devil, man, when trying that, to steal from you. When that calamity comes. You see what I'm saying? Now, you should, you might not want, want to hear it. But to see a man standing with a Bible and say shit, call that shit, that just shows me where you at and your disrespect for the Most High. This is his words. These ain't our words. This but this is what happened. That's prophecy. This is the book of Mark, chapter 4 and verse 14. The sword soweth the word. And that's what we are with farmers. Read. And these are they by the wayside. And that's where you at. You by the side of the road. Read. Where the word is sown. Uh-huh. But when they have heard, Satan come immediately. Who come immediately? Satan coming immediately. To do what? And take away the word that was sown in their hearts. Don't listen to that, sis. Don't listen to that shit. That was a spirit. That was a spirit talking out of that woman. And sis, remember that. Watch what happens. Something's going to happen. She'll call, girl, this, my, my, it's going to be tragedy. You watch. Some way or shape or how. I don't want to speak that over. No, you that don't speak it over. It's just what it is. The Lord is real. It's to happen to my family, me. It happens to everybody. So it's not personal. And it, and it won't stop. So do no you believe what? in a higher power, sis? I'm sorry. Do you believe in a higher power? I do. So do you believe that he's he's a he's a God? Uh, uh. I've been held for a long time, and I'm still being held. I have my situations and circumstances right now. This place, just out here on the streets. I mean, I'm in a room right now. Lost my home after over eight years, but I'm still smiling, still standing, and I'm still listening, whether I believe in what you said or not. Right, 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 right. That so I you, may or may not take. Right. Take I hear you. I hear you. So I'm going to ask you some honest questions then. So you have children? Yes, I do. What happens when you tell your child to do something and they don't do it? <laughs> what, what are you going to do? What happens when I tell my children to do something and I don't do it? And they don't do it. Not, not that, you. They don't do it. That's no, no, no. What happens when you tell your you got daughters? I have two boys. You have two boys. What happens when you tell your son such and such, do this son? And he said, no, nah, no. Oh, see that? Now that just changed the question. You see, that's the question that I'm asking. He uh, said, when they, them not doing it versus saying, no, no, <laughs> I, you get a different reaction. But I, I mean, I don't know. You know, it, it just depends on my mood, my mode. Okay, well, what if, what if you tell him to do something? He say, shut up. I don't want to hear that shit. See? <laughs> See? What's the, what's the point? That's what she just said. <laughs> that bring a whole nother you out. That's, that's what she just said to the most high. I don't want to hear that shit. That's exactly what she said. Yeah. See? Uh, you just put something in my mind that I don't want to think about. See? What were you gonna do? You about to get up. You finna, you didn't feel like getting off the couch, but now you finna get up off the couch. You see that? You see? I would never try to speak death on people, man. I wouldn't do that, just, just so you know. I just tell it like it is, because he said, spare not. Show my people their transgressions. So that's Isaiah, what we ordered to do. 58 and one, Isaiah 58 and one. Yeah, so we, we out here for the people. And we appreciate you. The Most High appreciates you stopping and hearing. Because not everybody stopping and listen. Some people say, I don't want to hear that shit. Some people stay, they don't leave. 
You see what I'm saying? But if you stand, that's because the most high, he's talking to you and you're receptive. But you, you're being a little bit more receptive. You see what I'm saying? And I know our people have a trust issue because we've been lied to, we've been let down. That's what our pastors did, our leaders. But this is the truth. We're reading it out the Bible. We're standing in the code. That's, that's where the misunderstanding comes in. But how many different variations of the Bible? It's only are one. There? No, it's they? one truth. It's one truth. Give me uh, give me give me uh, Job thirty-four and thirteen. Let me bring this out. Give me Job thirty-four and thirteen, real quick. Give me Job. Hold 34, that and give me Job thirty-four and thirteen, real quick. Listen to this, sis. This is the book of Job, chapter 34 and verse 13. Who have given him a change give me, over... Give, hold on. 34 and 14. Four. 34. Or is it... Hold on, hold on. Real quick. Salaki, Salaki. We better not... Is it 23? Hold on. Real quick. Go back to 34. 34, is it 32? Give me, give me. No, the ear tribe, the word. The ear, the ear tribe words. So. Hear my words, amen. We got you, sir. So here, here it is, it's three. We got you, see? This the book of Job, chapter 34 and verse two. Hear my words, O ye wise men, and give ear unto me, ye that have knowledge. Right. For the ear trieth words. Read it again. For the ear trieth words. Right. As the mouth tasteth meat. Right, so you know, you know if we were telling you some, some lies. That's why you hear your ear is tasting these words. The ear trieth words as the mouth tasteth meat. You know when you hear a lie. You know when you heard something bad. You know it's good. You tasting it for yourself. And you're searching for a lie you haven't heard one yet. This is what a trust issue is. We're not, we not up here humming and singing. Why, we ain't got an A and B selection. We ain't got nothing to seduce you. We just got pure words for you, sis. The word's the truth. The truth is that you an Israelite. You were stolen from the land of the Hebrews and you have to return back to your God or you're going to perpetuate the same thing that you went through, right? Right now you said you lost your home. You're going to get that to your sons. They're going to be going through the same thing that you're going through. Who going to change? Who going to change? You said you had the answers. You've been trying it all your life. Do it the way of the Most High. He said, turn and keep my commandments. Why don't you trust him? And teach your sons to trust him. Right? Cause look, give me uh give me give me uh Deuteronomy 48 and uh 54. Cause this was gonna happen. If not. Deuteronomy 48. Yeah. This is the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28 and verse 54. Right? So that the man that is tender among thee, among you. And very delicate, his eyes shall be evil toward his brother. So if we don't change, we don't teach our sons to change, your son is going to hate his own people. Not only his own brother, but guess who else? And toward the wife of his bosom. He's going to leave his woman too. And guess what else? And toward the remnant of his children, which he shall leave. Your son will do the same thing his father did. If you don't change and teach him to keep the commandments of the Most High, he's going to hate his woman, he's going to hate his children, and he's going to leave them both to fend for themselves. That's what's going to happen. You gave me something to think about. Thank you for the message. All right, shalom, sir. With that, we